Hi guys, and welcome back to Renee GTV. Uh, today we're going to do a very simple, really cute, adorable craft, paperclip angels. And uh, what we're going to start out with are some butterfly paperclips, and you can buy these at Walmart. Actually, it was the cheapest place I found them, but Home Depot um, and Office Depot, places like that. We're also going to start out with some beads, and you just want a bead that has a hole that you can thread. And um, I bought these. They're just acrylic clear beads that I bought from Hobby Lobby. Uh, what we're going to do first is we are going to take some jump rings. And I bought those at Michael's. I don't know if you can see that. But I thought that kind of looked like a halo, a crown of thorns, something like that, um, that we're going to apply to the bead. So um, all we're going to do is take some hot glue. And I do apply it next to the hole okay just like that and then I place my little jump ring right there on top and then we let that cool completely and that's what we're left with okay um, now we're going to thread our paper clip and I've taken just some purple you can use any color that you want I've taken some purple ribbon and we're gonna I'm gonna walk you through that process so the the um, ribbon that I'm using is three millimeters by um, 9.1 millimeters okay and I have cut that about 14 inches it's gonna really depend on um, how long you want this I'm gonna take my bead and I'm just going to thread that through both ends okay and then and then I've taken my thread or my ribbon and it's three millimeters uh, by 9.1 meters and I'm just going to put that through the center portion of my Let's see if I can show you that the center portion of the paper clip right through that hole and then I'm going to just pull the ends up to me and this is about 13 inches or so of ribbon. It's just going to depend on how much ribbon you want. I'm going to pull it up just like that. Okay, and we're going to tie a knot right there. And I'm going to do that. This helps me keep both ends the same length. Okay, that's one. We're going to do that one more time around. Okay, and we're going to pull it tight. Very simple. Now we're going to take both ends and I'm just putting those together. We're going to take one of our beads that has the halo already attached. And we're just going to thread our ribbon right through that bead very easy to do with the three millimeter ribbon and you want to pull both ends tight just like that okay that's our little head of our angel now I'm going to tie a knot right up to that top of that bead where that other hole is and we're just going to Pull that tight, just like that, okay? Very simple and easy to do. Now we're going to go ahead and tie to where we'll have a little hanger right here. And you can see that this was probably a bit more than enough as far as the ribbon goes for me because I don't want this one too long. But really it just depends on where you want to hang it. These are cute as Christmas ornaments hanging from your mirrors. Um, you know just hanging wherever you want we're gonna pull that knot tight and we are left with that I'm gonna go ahead and cut the end off like that now we're going to take our ribbon and we're just going to tie a bow okay and I'll kind of show you how I do that real quickly Okay, I just make a loop and I hold it. I pull the, sh the uh, ribbon behind it. 
and then I make my other loop and I pull it through and then you want to tighten it and then you're just going to make your your bow as large as you want it okay and there is our our bow just like that and you can cut off the ends and make it um, how you want it to be now I'm going to take my angel have six six millimeter um, ribbon that I'm actually using for the bow but you can use the three millimeter I'm going to take a hot glue gun and I'm going to take my bow and the back part of my bow is where I'm going to place my glue okay and then I'm just going to glue it straight down right there at the tie of where we placed our ribbon through the paper clip. I'm going to let this dry and I'll show you what she looks like. Okay, so here is our finished paper clip angel. Absolutely adorable and cute. Again would be great as Christmas gifts or ornaments uh, or just to hang in a child's room or anywhere you'd like. Uh, you can find these on my Etsy store so go take a look at that. Um, the link is in the show more box. If you have any questions or comments don't forget to leave them down below. Uh, thumbs up guys and share me on Facebook and Twitter with all your friends and family. I appreciate all the great support. As always guys thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.